Hi, I'm Carmen Shamas. Today I'm going to talk about Saturday the 26th of uh, October. Today the moon is in Libra and uh, the sun is of course in Scorpio. So how is it going to be for all the signs? Aries, it can be a, uh, an upsetting uh, Saturday. It can be a bit difficult. It can be tough or it can be just a normal Saturday. All you have to do is be flexible and try to move with the flow. Try not to resist what is happening and you think that it is opposing you. Just flow with it. The most tense can be those born um, in March or those born between the 1st and the 10th of April. Let's move on to Taurus. Taurus, it's a very long day. You have a long Saturday ahead of you and it can go on and continue till um, uh, Sunday. So I suggest that uh, in order to make it an easy going Saturday, you have to plan well, um, prioritize and try to work uh, according to schedule. Uh, look after your health, look after your um, uh, mental health, uh, try to be more confident, try to detox. Uh, the luckiest can be those born on the 5th, 6th, 12th, 13th of May. Gemini, it's a very nice day, um, uh, relatively speaking, uh, knowing that the past two days were not that excellent. So today is a good day. It can be, um, uh, it can work uh, with you to your favor definitely with the moon in an air sign so you have to try maybe you need to take the initiative in all cases it's a good day it's very promising and sunday also the luckiest are those born on the 12th and the 13th of june cancer it can be a day related um to some personal issues that you really want and need to get over with. So it doesn't mean it's a tough day. It's a good day if you just take things as they are and look at the uh, at everything around you positively. You can find a solution to every problem you may encounter, you may encounter today. So don't worry about that. Uh, since the sun is in Scorpio, so positively speaking, it's um, everything can be solved. So the, um, the luckiest uh, are those born in the month of uh, June. Let's move on to Leo. Leo, it's a nice day. Uh, the most positive thing about today's Saturday, it's the moon in Libra because it gives you great ideas. It gives you this spark that you have in your ideas in the way you think. Uh, so definitely it's a great day for a gathering, definitely it's a good day to study, definitely it's a great day to prepare for your meetings for next week also. You have great ideas, you have uh, smart moves also, you are very dynamic, so it's a great day. The luckiest are those born on the 14th and the 15th of August. Virgo, it's another great day, everything seems, everything looks perfect, um, it seems that everything is moving in the right direction um, with the moon in your sign um, on Thursday and Friday in the past two days uh, definitely you're moving in a new direction there is a new start there's a new phase there's a new page waiting for you all you have to do is be smart enough to know that you really need to introduce a change into your life or to welcome a change in your life the luckiest are those born on the 28th 29th of august 8th 9th 14th 15th of september i move on to libra libra uh, definitely with the moon in your sign you seem to be one of the uh, luckiest or the strongest most dynamic um, signs today uh, because not only the moon is in your sign, it's the sun is in Scorpio, which is an empowering uh, planetary position. So everything seems to move on. Uh, you are almost like Virgo. There is a change moving on. There's a move. There's a new page, a new decision. Um, it may take place today. It may take place tomorrow. So if you just... Um, push a little bit, everything will turn out to be perfect for you. However, planet Mars is still in your sign, so you have to be careful if you were born between the 7th and the 9th of October. Let's move on to Scorpio. Scorpio, this is, um, uh, it can be a slow day. 
uh, you may feel a little bit uh, confused that things are not working out as planned you definitely need a plan b or a plan c watch out double check on your bookings things may turn out to be completely different and you don't want to end up being a loser today since the sun is in your sign you should expect new changes and good changes so try to avoid putting yourself in an embarrassing situation. Take it easy and wait till the moon reaches your sign on Sunday, 8.30 p.m. Universal Time. Uh, planet Venus is in your sign, so you can be quite lucky if you were born between the 12th and the 14th of November. I move on to uh, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, I like the moon in Libra. It energizes you, it empowers you, it gives you a new look, a new energy positive energy, you are charismatic and you're able to reach out to others. It's a good day to mix and mingle. It's a good day not to stay on your own. It's a perfect day to go out and lobby around. Um, um, you have to know that you have to finish whatever you need to finish before the weekend ends. Excuse me, before the weekend ends. Um, um, you have till, let me see, till Sunday, 8.30 p.m. Universal Time to finish everything important you have. Otherwise, you will have to double check and watch the, uh, the, the, the videos uh, for daily forecasts for, Mondays and, for Monday and Tuesday. On the other side, on the positive side, Planet Jupiter is still in your sign and you can be quite lucky if you were born on the 13th and the 14th of uh, December. However, don't play your winning card today nor tomorrow if you can. Let's move on to Capricorn. Capricorn, um, actually I like the, um, the sun in Scorpio for you. It empowers you. Uh, you've been through tough times with the sun in, in Libra for the past four weeks, but now the moon is in Libra again. It's like it's giving you another a taste of uh, what was going on in the past four weeks. However, it's just um, a passing, a temporary uh, period. So uh, try to be as responsible as you can. Um, it's just today and tomorrow, then things will turn themselves out to be uh, okay and more relaxed so all you have to do is put up with everything going on try to be as responsible as possible and try to make things work out to the benefit of everybody don't antagonize anybody today especially if you were born on the 5th 6th 11th 12th of january okay let's move on to um, aquarius i like the moon in libra for you it really it um, smooths things out. It's been a tough week for you. So today it's a good day. It's a reward for you. You have to take in all the positive energy that you can. You have to charge yourself, recharge yourself. You're uh, going to um, uh, invest in this weekend because it's a good weekend for you. It's empowering. It's good. And you need all the positive energy before Monday because Monday and Tuesday you'll be under the influence of the new moon in Scorpio, which squares your sun from the highest part in your uh, astral chart in your sky. So um, having said that, you have to recharge your batteries today, tomorrow. Uh, maybe you really need to make up, make it up to your friends, to your loved ones, to yourself, resolve some issues, uh, laugh a lot, enjoy your time, stay away from negative people, stay away from troubles. If you have some duties to do, responsibilities, do them and then relax and enjoy your time. Stay away from problems and negative people. The luckiest are those born on the 17th, 18th of February. I move on to Pisces. Pisces, you actually, you're happy with the moon not being in Virgo. For the past two days, it has been in, it was in, in, in Virgo and it was a bit challenging. Today, the moon is in Libra and it's asking you to make amends. Don't spoil the energy of the sun in Scorpio. So you have the uh, opportunity to make things um, good again. 
uh, maybe you really need to make that phone call maybe you really need to apologize you should be flexible today and you should be very diplomatic and then everything will be quite fine and you will be for good su surprises on monday and tuesday the luckiest can be those born on the 12th or the 13th of march so this is it for saturday the 26th of october i wish you all a great day and see you tomorrow bye bye